And President Mamadou Buhari has ordered security agencies to eradicate crude oil theft and pipeline vandalism in the Niger Delta before May 29. The president, who was represented by the Minister of State for Petroleum Resources, Timipri Silva, said these while addressing security agencies in Port Harcourt, River State. He noted that due to the sealed up security efforts of the federal government, it has helped to shore up production to about 1.5 million barrels per day. The president um, mandated us to come here and give his commendation uh, to the officers and men of the armed forces who have been involved in the fight against oil theft. We have seen significant improvement since we started this fight and we, Mr. President thought it was fitting for us to come and give this commendation to further bolster the morale of the armed forces. Uh, we are not exactly where we ought to be, uh, but uh, we have also charged them to the double effort to ensure that uh, oil theft is a thing of the past. Mr. President, really I want to leave that as a legacy uh, before he exits on May 29 to ensure that uh, oil theft has been uh, totally dealt with. In his remarks, the Chief of Defense Staff, CDS General Loki Rabo, urged the security agencies to remain steadfast in the campaign to halt crude oil theft in the country. Motivation that has come from this commendation will be, you know, some form of verve that will enable us to pep up, you know, what we're doing to ensure that um, the desire of Mr. President is achieved overall. And I think that that's what we'll be looking at, reassessing um, the gaps, uh, what has made us to make this impact, what has not made us to be so effective, and how to close it up. So this is precisely what we will do. And I also would like to use this opportunity to say that um, what this has indicated is that there's a need for everyone to have his hand on the plow. It's a collective effort uh, which, um, you know, more or less validates that position that together we will win. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.